Hello, everybody, and welcome to another edition of Conscious Songwriting Interviews, where we are blessed to have a man who I only met three years ago, but has had a tremendous impact on mine and my wife's life through the work he's done to help other artists. Not only other artists, other organizations who are into the type of music that we were blessed to not only write, but enjoy. So without further ado, I bring to you one of the founders of Empower Music and Arts, Mr. Richard McDesey. What's up, Richard? <laughs> Whoa, John. Thanks, Hi. brother. Well, um, my songs weren't. My songs were being sung in churches, and they were, you know, they were, um, I would write them to teach a lesson. You know, I wanted to demonstrate a spiritual uh, law or, or something, um, uh, you know, a way to live or a way to look at things. But I wasn't putting a lot of myself into them. Uh, there wasn't a lot of Richard, a lot of vulnerability, a lot of where I'm coming from, a lot of you know, people could listen to my songs and learn stuff, but they didn't. They couldn't listen to my songs and really know who I am. You know, what's well, what's Richard about? You know, kind of get an idea. You listen to Billy Joel's song and you hear the angst and and you know how he's feeling and he, and he just puts it out there. How I feel about this person or that person or how love is. A, I didn't have a lot of of that personal stuff and my uh, vulnerability and and you know putting a lot of who I am into songs. And once I started doing that, and, and it hasn't been that long, just recently, so there's only a few songs out there now that I'm really trying to trying to put emotion into and, and let people know who I am. So I think that was a big uh, a big turn for me and, uh, you know, as, as far as my songwriting progress. Uh, if I want to be an artist and if I want to go out and, and uh, play and have people interested, they have to get to know me through my music. That's and, cool. uh, so that's where I've kind of turned my focus. I don't know if that was directly answering your question. No, but that's perfect. That's what yeah. comes to mind when you're at it.